aim of the United Nations' seventh Sustainable Development Goal is to ensure access to affordable, reliable, sustainable, and modern energy for all. As is common knowledge by this point, climate change is caused by the emission of greenhouse gases, such as carbon dioxide, into the atmosphere, a major part of which can be traced back to energy production. It is unquestionable that we need to find renewable, clean energy sources if we want to even hope for a sustainable future. The specific targets of SDG 7 are succinct, but as with all SDGs, will require specific and consistent efforts to be reached by 2030. Hoping to make the world a more equitable place, SDG 7 includes the goal of universal access to affordable and reliable electricity, and the percentage of people with electricity has been on the rise, up from 83% in 2010 to almost 90% in 2017, but that still leaves over 750 million people around the world without electricity. Worldwide, there is a serious dependency on fossil fuels and unclean energy sources. Even if access is increasing, many people still lean on traditional energy sources because they are seen as more reliable and more affordable. Part of SDG 7 is thus to increase accessibility, but also to improve the reputation of clean energy so that we can start seriously increasing the share of renewable energy. Currently, renewable energy makes up 17.5% of total energy consumption, a figure that has only grown by 18% since the introduction of the SDGs. While this is a first step, we need to foster the growth of renewable energy by far more than that. It is not enough to simply use more renewable energy. Another target of SDG 7 is to double the global rate of improvement in energy efficiency so that we use less energy overall. That rate of improvement was at 2.5% in 2017, falling short of the 2.7 target demanded by SDG 7. If we're falling short, how can we meet our goals? One of the major ways that nations can move towards a future that includes sustainable energy is by investing heavily in energy infrastructure and supporting companies and research groups that want to look into more sustainable energy. Of particular importance is international cooperation on these efforts and making sure to help developing countries meet their sustainability goals in a way that does not put them at a disadvantage as compared to richer countries. Some of the most positive steps in this area is the development of microgrids which allow people to produce their own renewable energy and share excess with their community, and the continuous effort of many nations to make nuclear fission energy a reality. With it, we could drastically reduce emissions related to energy production and achieve a truly sustainable and affordable energy source for our future. Ironically, there is some good that has come out of the current pandemic. Carbon emissions are set to decrease by 6% because of the upheaval caused by COVID-19. While one should approach this statistic with caution, it does not tell the whole story of economic downturn and general upset. It is evidence that serious changes in our behavior are necessary if we want to drastically reduce our global CO2 emissions, part of which will be to set nations on a path towards clean and renewable energy. This is a goal where we all have a part to play. Actively decrease your own energy consumption and try, where possible, to switch to renewable energy sources yourself. Support startups with energy saving ideas and be more considerate of how you use and potentially waste energy. We can do this together.